Here we're looking at the condition which uh, stops our loop. So we have taken in a number given by the user and set it to a variable called number of sides. So the user is telling us how many sides they want to a shape, for example. This code here inside the while loop says that if the number of sides is less than three or the number of sides is greater than eight, then obviously this is not between three and eight. And so we want them to re-input the number until they've done that. So we say while the number of sides is less than three or the number of sides is greater than eight, then ask the user for another input. And we keep going around that loop until they get an input that we want. And then we can proceed to drawing the shape. So we've used here what is called a Boolean condition. A condition says number of sides is less than three. So that's either going to be true or false. Number of sides is greater than eight, true or false. And if this is true or this is true, we're still going to stay in the loop. Once one of them, once they become false, we can then drop down to here. We can now put in a length, we can calculate our angle, and then we can move through a loop to draw the triangle. So let's see if that works. I'm going to run. I'm going to put in the number two. And you see, it asked me for a new number. If I put in nine, it will also ask me for a new number. If I put in four, then the turtle draws a square. Now, the other condition that you have to put in for the task is that we don't want them to allow, we don't want to allow the user to draw any shapes which are have side length seven. So we put another condition or number of sides equals seven. And now we can test that. If they put in the number seven, again, it still asks them for a number. And if we put in three, we should get a triangle. 